absolutely annihilated me. Yeah, yeah it's, it's maintained. Uh, if you're if you're a risk player, you're at you're at risk. We'll talk about that more later because the game has started. We've got a quick push into the connector position there. Guardian winning behind the smoke. Hello! You will greet them and they will fall. And his feet. And that is a beautiful return though. Very quickly, Kadian coming in with a 2k to give the advantage to North as they hold on to forward position. Still can't quite secure that A-bomb plant just yet though. There is range just you know, watching by ticket. So how do they get to... Oh! oh that's nasty! <laughs> that was... You, oh man, that was satisfying Ooh. as hell. But who's going to win the pistol? Now we've got a two versus one situation. Really awkward for AZ to peek out of the palace. Generally speaking, you don't want your palace guy peeking all the way to CT. That is for other people to deal with. But they don't really have the personnel to make the most ideal choices. Valde out in the open. His teammate's rotating. And maybe they realized what was going on there because there's no trade attempt. So they've realized that he could be coming from the ramp. Nico not showing, only to Palace. Rain, some shoulder peeking. Two versus one. Who engages first? If Rain engages first, to Rain's left. Right there, Nico can pop out afterwards. You can see AZ's looking for the trade fragger. He has no idea where the other person is. Nico not showing at all. And there it is, the double peek. Three, two, one, peek. Hey! Like the A1 a lot. My, pro honest. my problem, though, is that I always mentally do an M4A4 spray with the M4A1 and it's not shooting people in, in their belt and stuff. It's, 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 yeah, it's a very different play style. I think Forrest is probably the best player to watch because of the way that he takes engagements with the M4A1S is, is, is a bit different for sure. Kind of like a 4.46 kind of style where you just like yeah, try to peek yeah. a sliver peek, uh, two shot things. Yeah, I should try that then. I was going <laughs> to say that's why it feels better to me because I was much better in 1.6 with rifles than in this game. This or they're taking control of this connector. They're getting torn up the floor up. All of my skin, two kills on the catwalk. K or B, not K or B. <laughs> <laughs> Someone tweeted me about that and said, Can you tell your your co commentator? I see Jay there. And okay. I, I replied and said, I'm actually enjoying it. So I'm just gonna <laughs> leave him leave him to go down. And Rain is still in that default position. Going for the inverse plant. No one really checking this area. And that's the round over. Just like that. Now it's a case of oh. hiding for Kyabi for the most part because the time is so low. We saw in the last game somebody died after time. I think it was Kyabi as well. <laughs> AK-47. Oh dear, they're closing the distance, but there is some cover though for Rain. So Guardian's holding his left and got a player around triple. Could be some spray from Connector as well. And there it is from Nico. People knowing their angles through the smokes now for the uh, triple plant and the inverse plant. Getting harder and harder to do in Pro CS. Yeah, I agree completely. And it definitely punishes teams who try to do the 4-1 setups. And speaking of they which... Nice so quiet quick. shot. Yeah. And a silencer on that AWP. <laughs> does he go for the gap? Ooh, he does, but he's seen that there's another player. That might be a warning. I don't know if the bomb might come up on the radar there. By the window, tagged. Now he fragged Kyabi. Gade taken out by Carrigan. I keep wanting to call him Caden. It's so annoying, but here is Caden. One versus four. Guardian will finish him off face down on the couch. So, like I'm gonna hit A, like maybe the first couple rounds and kind of mix it up. Like you have a, a structure. Yeah. Oh, and here are the grenades again. They're the same grenades, but this time it is a B play from them. One play comes out quickly. However, that might be a warning. Carrigan is still alive. His teammate coming through the smoke. Three CTs now on the B bomb site for Phase. The bomb's been dropped, and AZ finds himself quickly on his own. And they only get one kill out of that North. <laughs> well, this is a rough round for North. 20 seconds to plant the bomb. And they can't even really find a position to swarm. So where Rain is standing now, some people call that get right. As the off angle for people coming out of A. Few people call it Scream as well. Call it Ninja. You call it Ninja. ninja so yeah. Ninja is the other side of fireboxes for yes. most people. Yeah. But I'm talking about the big oh. round door. Oh, we'll, actually, we'll, I don't even know that. I don't think we okay, can we can take a look out. at it. Because I, I play, play a lot of pugs, so we don't call that out. <laughs> <laughs> we just die. Okay. Monsieur Sligwell, if you... It's a defensive smoke as well. This is so difficult now for the T's. How do you break that position? There's no Molotovs. You can see that he's playing with these angles. Gets the first frag, and now the F from that point becomes very difficult. You can see Valdiv pressing to try to trade. Here comes another trade attempt, not working out until Gade finds him. But too much damage has already been done. That's, that defensive smoke is so strong on Shadow. I, I love that we're seeing these days more defensive smoke play from the CTs as well. It's so cool to see. I actually started doing that one a lot recently as well. It's really fun to play around. Oh, oh dear. What's going on there? Maybe he had a weird mouse problem. Wireless okay. mouse has a rechargeable battery. I don't know, I just, I just, I just play. Attention to detail. Three out of ten. 
many targets in the mid position. Now a few targets. Guardian may spot another player there. Very smart to get the Molotov out just in case they try and push, and they try and push. Through the Molotov, the chase Ooh. continues, but it's Guardian after all. Sit down. First of all, we have a fast pace towards the A bomb site. So they want to speed things up. It's a very poor flashbang from Kadian, and Nico is still able to strafe, swipe rather, and get the kill. Rain by that ninja spot. But Gade will take him down. 2k for Gaze. Nico, did he see an arm? Maybe he did. He smoked off now, though. Do it, do it, do it. Oh, the timing. Oh! So they shoot towards the bench. He heard the jump. Five bullets left. 3v3 for the retake. Last round, got to go for it. Seems there may be a boost. All three players with kits. They've got a lot of utility. Vale looking for the boost. Here it comes, but Nico's ready. No, someone will likely be watching. Kyabi remains with Gade, going for the big rotation. Two plays still in mid, spots one. Will there be a peek from Olaf Myers? Does he go forward? Does he go back? He goes back. And it's Kyabi left. That bomb is ticking. The flashbang will be avoided. They're watching the angles of the player on the stairs to try and distract him. Olaf Meister hits his second kill of the round. And just will Carrigan get the defuse. Maybe slow it down way much and then kind of change back up again. Fast. Ooh. Oh, there. Headshots abound. It's a pistol round, of course, on the bomb side here. Olaf Meister will plant safely in the smoke. Four versus three here for FaZe. Peter 50 on Nico. Looking very favorable right now for them. The international squads. And it's even better now. Oh, Nico with that P250. He's 15 for eight at the moment. This is rather hopeless. Do you want to save the kits? Probably save the kit at this point. And I was like, I don't care. Do the shadows impact that much though? Because I know like um, the shaders will, but the shadows. I'm so for that much every much. FPS at this point. Every <laughs> single <laughs> FPS. Every All the FPS Bottom you can get. The barrel. I'm, I'm trying to get it off. Oh, we've got the catwalk occupied now by FaZe, looking to push into ladder room. Seeing a two-man setup here from north, that's actually amazing. Really strong, if challenged. They know there's one player there. Hello, there's second one. Guardian, though, with the jumping MAC-10, takes full advantage of a lack of a helmet on Valde, and which makes that MAC-10 very strong. And Carrigan spots out Gade, so they uh, they recognize there were two players there, and that could have been very, very strong, but now north is just whittling away in this defense, leaving AZ to his own devices, and he... Never do A with smokes. Because <laughs> it just annoys me that no one knows anything but A with smokes on the team side. Even I can do it, James. But I'm, I, well, I'm always throwing like mid smoke, connect to smoke, or the smoke towards the window on B now. Yeah, actually, I never smoke CG spawn either. I'm usually on the other smoke. The jungle smoke is the one I'm always throwing. No one knows the jungle smoke, it seems like. Or a proper one. Yeah. My level fucks. Yeah. For the greater good. Push from phase towards B bomb site is what is being suggested. Carrigan with some big Ooh. frags opening up B. Now will they continue? Oh, the split is coming in. They're almost filling up for Kadian. Another opportunity. But just the one kill. AZ is the last man standing. Oh, Shock man. and war from B. He's still a strong player for the team. What is that? <laughs> <laughs> what is that? Well, is that even a wall shot? I've never, I've never even thought about continuing to shoot while I'm scoping. That's <laughs> not something I've ever even mentally processed. I don't even know if that was possible. See, he knows Here something you don't. Like really off key. Maybe if it's possible, we can get some extra slow mo. I don't know. No. Okay. No. Not the. <laughs> not getting good looks from the, <laughs> the gallery there. Um. Well, that's uh. It's gonna be round 15 coming in for phase. 15 to five. Again, you know, I think we could see that. There's been loads of rounds where North... Who is next? I'm just going to start just just holding Mouse 1 down when I'm jumping as well. I'm start doing that. That was a proper garden hose shot from Rain. <coughs> Watering all the plants. Oh, that would have been such an important C-man spray down. It is match point here for FaZe. Big shot from Valde, but he doesn't see the player behind Olaf Meister. And now Kadian is all that's left. Creeping through to the jungle position. Karagun surely will go for the triple plant. Kadian scoped in. He's got a long journey ahead of him. Got to run for it. Not sure if he's been heard. No, he hasn't been heard. Not yet. Karagun still looking towards connector. Scope of his own. 
Caden better be fast. That Krieger's very, very dangerous. Oh. There we go. 16 to 5. FaZe wow. with a uh, dominant two maps against North. And